Hi, this is Chef Yasin from Institute of Hotel Management. Today I will be demonstrating one of the recipes from Kashmiri Pandit cuisine. The name of the recipe is Chicken Kaliyam. The name comes from the color of the recipe, that's mustard color, and it resembles to the flowers of mustard. So the recipe has derived its name from the mustard fields or the color of mustard flowers in Valley. So first of all, we have to heat the oil in a vessel. When oil is hot, we'll start adding whole garam masala into it. The first goes brown cardamom, then peppercorn, green cardamom, clove, one stick of cinnamon, and bay leaf. As you can hear the spices are crackling, we'll be adding chicken pieces into it. We have blanched the chicken. We have blanched the chicken in garlic water. We have blanched the chicken in water and we have added whole uh, spices into it. And after that we will be adding chicken stock into it. We have not uh, added onion or we have not added garlic into the chicken. We have just blanched the chicken in water with whole uh, spices. As uh, Kashmiri Pandas, they do not eat uh, garlic and the onions normally. So we have kept the same uh, thing in mind and we have just blanched the chicken. Now we have to wait till the chicken, uh, the water boils and chicken gets a little tender. And after that, we will be adding spices into it. As uh, the chicken is boiling, we'll start adding spices into it. We'll start with the coriander powder, a pinch of coriander powder. Then we'll be adding some salt powder into it, that's fennel powder. Turmeric powder, as the color will come from this turmeric. Pinch of salt in the beginning and then we can adjust the seasoning later on. And now we will be adding ginger powder into it. Kashmiri Pandits, they use a lot of ginger powder into their recipe. So we are adding ginger powder into it. As it's boiling and spices have mixed up properly and the perfect color has come. As the chicken is uh, boiling, one more, in, uh, one more uh, ingredient we have to add, that's a liquid, and we'll be adding uh, uh, milk into it, and it gets the best color of the spices come off, and uh, after adding all the spices, we have to let it boil. We have to let it boil till the curry thickens and the chicken is very tender. So what we did is actually we uh, the oil we heated the oil and added the whole uh, garam masala that's from spices. Then we sauteed chicken into it and before that we had blanched chicken in water with whole uh, garam masala. And after sauteing the chicken we added some chicken stock and then moderate spices in the milk. And now it's uh, boiling and when chicken is tender and the curry thickens. We will be garnishing it with some dried fenugreek leaves and serving it hot. So we have to wait till the chicken boils.